Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Let's Design Sim City 4. My name is Rick Dolster, and we're back at River Crossing. And um, I was looking uh, at this uh, at this part of town um, off camera, and uh, I don't know if you remember, but uh, we measured traffic for this train station. Sorry, it just just went right in, almost no intro. Um, yeah, I was thinking uh, off camera that uh, since this uh, this station doesn't appear to be bringing any passengers. I was thinking maybe moving it to uh, this part of the um, of the track where I think this behaves like a freight station, so maybe it wasn't the bear, the best placement to have it right next to, next to this uh, rail yard. And I'm thinking maybe we can uh, just simply put uh, another one of these stations right on this uh, stretch of uh, rail, which uh, hopefully will um, will drive more people. By train and they don't so they don't use their cars and uh, let's do a nice entrance into the station something like that uh, let's bring back the bus stop like so I was also thinking of uh, maybe we can do a bit of a uh, walking area next to it just a, a little bit of a, a tiny park in the industrial area I think that could work well because this is kind of like a commuter station place thing we can make it look uh, a bit nice, even though it's an uh, industrial area. These people deserve uh, better better infrastructure, I guess. We'll see if, if it gets used, but uh, for the time being, let's just uh, do something like this. Something like that. We can have uh, some ends and chess plaza, sure, so you can play chess while you wait for the train. Uh, Chevalier Cannon. Yeah, let's have a cannon. <laughs> there we go. Right next by the train station. Why not? And let's just have a nice, uh, simple curve over yonder. There we go. That kind of works. I wish that, uh, maybe, you know what? Maybe we can just do this and have another. No, no, we're absolutely going to need. Uh, going to need this uh, parts to be touching the station. It doesn't feel right. I think this ones don't add up very well. I think we need the transitions to sidewalks. But it's uh, probably a bit too big. There we go. Oh, that's actually the other way around. I always that always happens. Uh, unfortunately, it's not overriding the curve. But that. Uh, that actually looks better, so I might just uh, keep it. I chose the wrong one. There we go. Once again, it seems about right. Or does it? Oh, there's one. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's do this better. Let's do this better. I know there's one that we used before for the uh, sidewalks. Small park, three by one. Not necessarily what I'm looking for. Where's the one uh, sliding straight? I think it's this one. That is just basically park and sidewalk. That's, uh, that might be what we need. Actually, this is way simple. Let's see if we can find a... with a kiosk. Something like that. That kind of works. In fact, let's just put the kiosk on this side. Like so, and uh, diagonal short. Sliding diagonal. Not sure what I want. Oh, oh, this is so perfect. Yes, we're sticking with this. It's a lot more simple. And uh, kind of what I was uh, looking for. Uh, let's do two by one, I think. So we have benches there. Now that's a beautiful station. Now let's just let's just hope that uh, there's traffic. Come on. Only, wait, this doesn't make any sense. Let, let me go full speed real quick. There are trains, 106 freight trains, zero freight trains, none and freight trains over there. How is this possible? Trains should be coming from both directions. Let me see if I can get a nice, can I not get a thing here? Oh, if I delete that, it's going to destroy everything. Hmm. 
Maybe that will help. Actually, no. You know what? We need the other way around. So we want trains to... Let's have this, like that. And uh, technically, you want to go like this, or you want to go... Sort of like that. That way they're all connected, right? Except th this one with a further, uh, further to this side. I'm not sure. This this should eventually work. I can. I, oh, there we go. Boom. Fantastic. It just needed a better connection. That's great. So now, now people will start uh, looking for jobs here. Hopefully, not driving their cars. And um, I kind of wish that I could put down some more trees. Let's let me grab one of the bubbles. Let's do a, a, a row of bubble trees. Just making this industrial area pretty, I guess, is uh, what I'm trying to do now. And oh, this is not right. It's really difficult to demolish as well. There we go. Boom. I didn't want that. I wanted the grass, which should be up here. There we go. Fantastic. And now what I want to do is I'm thinking of gating the this whole area because it kind of belongs to the rail yard, if you think about it. So let me go into the fence menu, which should be down here, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it is. There we go. Uh, so maybe we can keep... Oh, that was, that was a close one. Maybe we can keep uh, the fences looking outward. And do something along these lines. We're gonna fill this with props most likely now that we know how to use the how to use this garbage props. I wish they all behave like that. Yeah. What you gonna do, man? Okay. Rotate it. Perfect. Let's find some nice little curves. Uh, same over here. And uh, we should probably, yeah, you know what? Let's just uh, do this and do that. Probably not that. <laughs> that that was a bad idea. Not that. There we go. Fantastic. And over in this corner, I mean, I guess we can do the same thing, but mm, no, I don't want curves there. In fact, I don't think I want curves here or here. Let's just bring this back. There we go. And uh, right over here, let's see, what can we do? I don't want everything to be like absolutely aligned and perfect. It could be something like this. Oh, in fact, right here we can do the alley one that is uh, that has props in it. Something like that. Let's go find uh, the empty one, the empty space. Fill this in. Uh, maybe even have a... Can leave the, a gap in the middle for the road ones. So you see some marks. Uh, oh, wait, I can do something like this. Check this out. Not sure if this will work, but uh, we'll, we'll give it a shot. Uh, so I need the end section over there and over there and over here and over here and then we're just going to complete everything with the tire markings i don't know how this will look or how what what does this even mean <laughs> but uh, i guess we're, we're doing it <laughs> it's happening there we go there we go it just adds a bit more texture to the floor so i'm guessing just think about this as in a car that just drives across somehow through all these uh, rail uh, switches, and it just gets in here, deposits all the um, cargo, and then maybe eventually car puts the cargo back on the on the on the trains, something like that. But uh, it's not gonna look like that until I add props, and props is what we're gonna do now. Well, first of all, I think we need one of these trailer pieces. Come on. We get a better one. Some of them are really big. And I guess that's it. Let's bring this back. 
it's gonna be it's gonna be uh, quite an interesting journey plopping plopping things in here let's let's just keep the small one the first that appears there we go and uh, industrial props just uh, some random props you see it's a bit less restrictive this mod it can even be plopped against uh, the fences which most uh, of the other props don't really allow which is kind of fantastic clicking like crazy in case you didn't know and, and didn't notice the sound of my mouse in fact you know oh we have like little cars we can even put cars in here um let me see or a little truck i think a truck will make more sense but i don't think we have trucks so let's just give it a shot with one over here there we go so one car parked over there let's put another one over here all right that looks that looks nice and enough uh oh i guess i can plop some of these there we go some of these barrels I thought uh, I thought this was like a different kind of mod, but uh, but I guess the one the one that was basically plubble everywhere was the mixed industrial thing, where there's just basically tons of random props, which look amazing by the way, they really do. I mean, look at that. Now this whole place, and we can leave some spaces empty as well. But I'm, I'm feeling that this is the area where construction is kind of happening. These dumpsters that are right next to each other don't, don't actually look so bad. There we go. Now that's an industrial area. What do you think about that? <laughs> um, let's mix it up over here a bit if we can. Just to like make everything match, you know. There we go. So random props, fantastic. This makes uh, this area right now, right now, and uh, I like it. I think it's looking good. I feel like this could use more trees, but uh, well, I guess I guess we can add more trees. Yeah, let's add a few trees over here, but just a few, not a lot. <laughs> I, and I, I, as I just say that, the game is just gonna render a gazillion trees. That's that's more than enough. There we go. No chestnuts this time. Just keeping it uh, simple. Let's see how how's traffic now. Wow, four hundred. This this should have changed the graph real quick. Uh, I'm sure it did. Yeah, car is kind of declining when I started my mass transit uh, routes, which is quite interesting. There's still uh, there's still um, a lot more commute by car, but uh, hopefully that will go down slowly, uh, but surely. This is looking good. All right, everything's looking great. So uh, I think I consider this little part done for now uh i think this whole area could use a bit more uh, detail the the shores are a bit non a bit uh how to say it missing trees <laughs> uh so let's uh take care of that real quick just put a bunch of trees i haven't done any uh big rocks or stones lately simply because i I've, I've been looking at them i don't think they look great if I, I mean, they look okay, like every once in a while, but I, if I, I feel like if I do it too often, it's just not that great. This, this I love. I love how this ended. We need to do more of these. We most certainly need to do more of these. Let's put down some of these greener trees over here. And uh, some ashes. I feel like I'm all over the place today. It's okay. Just bear with me. It's been a, it's been a long day of recording today, and uh, huh. 
I think, I think this whole area is just, it's already done. Even though I was putting down trees over here. Let's grab, uh, not beaches. Let's grab the chestnuts, of course. Just filling some of the blanks. Try not to go too crazy, but it's just, I can't, I can't, I can't really help it. So we have some trees in there. We should probably take a look at this little corner over here. Let's bring uh, some of the ashes as well. Just uh, try to hide the imperfections of the of the road a little bit. Uh, let's bring the chestnuts real quick. Just leave that as it is. Probably get some more over here. Mix it up with some ashes. All right, that seems okay. So now let's uh, let's take a look at uh, one of the neighborhoods that we did not so long ago. This whole area, I remember when we shown this, it was a couple episodes, but I, I think I forgot to show it on camera how it turned out. I think it looks fantastic. I don't know what you guys think, but uh, there's so much green going on here. The houses are not abandoned uh, for the most part, I guess. Are you abandoned? You're not abandoned. Everything is perfect. What are you, why are you complaining? I noticed too that uh, I didn't really add a budget to <laughs> demolishing toasters. That's funny. I didn't really add a budget to schools and and clinics and such. And I think, yeah, it's all the way, all the way down in some cases. I'm I'm gonna boost uh, boost these up. Can I add more <laughs> to the? Yeah. It's just uh, fun. All these, uh, all these. Um, I wanted to boost the church. That's what I was trying to say. What? That was a dumb joke. Uh -huh. And and it's even worse now because I'm explaining it. Good job, man. Good job. <laughs> let's um, let's take a look. Why wow, this is a nice weird factory. It's like sunken. Love it. Um, let's see. There were more schools, I think. Maybe that's one of the reasons why these guys are all abandoned and crying. Private school, not under my command, of course. Just scrolling, scrolling. You should probably hit safe. Just to be safe, you know? Because uh, it's been a while since I saved the game and I, we did quite a bit so far. And also, it's 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 nice that we're in part of the, in this part of the map because I wanted to do something with this town for for quite some time now. I think it just needs a big park in the middle, but uh, something's got to give because there's not enough room otherwise. Increase the school funding over here. What's your problem right now? Pollution low, garbage low, everything is slow, and everything that needs to be good is high. So what? Why are you like that? I don't I don't get it. It's probably because of education, I think. Let's take a look at the uh, education graph real quick because I haven't I never do this. Education, there we go. So it, it has gone down and now it's going up. So I guess that's that's good. We'll 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 consider that good. Okay, so let me demolish the police station here. And replop it maybe right next door, across the street. I mean, small police station. There we go. Boom. Oh, I haven't, I haven't uh, increased the thing on this thing. There we go. Same goes with police. And right over here, we should put a park. And maybe that will change the outlook on this. Uh, let's just uh, have a mix of uh, filler trees. And grass. Actually, you know, you know what? Instead of having grass, let's just have uh, the opposite of that. <laughs> let's just have the exact opposite of this. There we go. So now it's like a nice little downtown plaza. 
with trees and not nothing else well some some plants uh on the on the side this will be a nice downtown area i think i just wish that there weren't abandoned buildings for some reason but uh doesn't seem doesn't seem like it like it looks uh, terribly bad now hopefully this uh this buildings will be rebuilt or not i don't know <laughs> i don't even know Let's change the funding on this. This is more. Uh, this is going to be more of a uh, let's tour the city kind of episode. We're going to be fixing things here and there. Some of these uh, flower gardens are a bit too repetitive. Let's change it with the uh, plopable trees that are really like they fill the space a lot more. <laughs> now this looks a bit repetitive, but not that much. So area looks nice. There's a bit of traffic issues over in this corner, but it's just so minor that it doesn't... And honestly, I don't even know how to fix it. Like, should I add more lanes to this? I don't think there's a, an overpass for that. So, like this massive jungle by the by the freeway. Let me hide all this ugly menus. Let me zoom out real quick so you can take a look at, uh, at the city. It's so, so easy to identify the commercial... Uh, cores and, and the medium the mix medium densities uh, in here so you can see here we have some definitely taller buildings over this uh, BC intersections and uh, it's quite nice we have not done any schools over on this side maybe we should worry about that a little bit and also we can start zoning uh, right here in the back so let's uh, let's do some work and not uh, not talk all the time. I will still be talking all the time. I'm sure you know that by now. I'm sure you do. So we're gonna have that, and we're gonna have this, and this is gonna be all filled with trees. Uh, we do have that uh, private school, but we should do a big, like, hmm, like um, high school or central, oh, I haven't done any of that either. Central Fire Station. Should probably put down some of these uh, fire service. Maybe on the other side of the island because you know, and the industry gets ca catches on fire sometimes. Not sure. <laughs> Who knows, right? Who knows? Can I? Maybe there's no room for this. I mean, unless we demolish a bunch of stuff. But uh, not really. I mean, there's some room here, but... Uh, oh, this guy has no car access. I need to take care of that. What did you grow in the first place if you didn't have a car access, man? Uh, let's just uh, put it over here. And I have an idea. Let's maybe expand this a little bit. And somehow connect to this... Something like this, so we can curve that up, curve this up, and uh, now there's more room for more industrial, of course. Let's go so in high density over here, there we go, that is a terrible idea. Don't do that, thank you very much. There we go. So now that we have this, it would be nice to have a... Uh, hmm. Just a... Uh, to have a park here. I, I feel like this whole area could be a park. And I don't see a, any uh, a better opportunity to make that a park. So let me let me finish this this whole area right here. Let me get uh, some more right here. We're going to probably zone a bit more medium density commercial. Something along those lines. Oh, no, 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 that's not what I wanted. Let's bring this up. I, you have to be freaking kidding me right now. There we go. So now everything is leveled and awesome. Uh, I guess I didn't have to do that. <laughs> I could just use, could have done that. 
Well, yeah, no, I needed that tile anyways. Uh, no worries, no worries. Uh, we should put a nice little park in there as well. There we go. And schools, yes. Let's not forget about the schools. Can you please think of the children? A uh, large high school, there we go. Oh, this one is huge. I don't think I've ever plopped this one. Is this a mod or a Maxis one? Hmm. I think it will be better if I put this in a central area so that it covers, hopefully, the most, you know, students. Could just be like this. And have, like, a nice park in the back. Let's give this a shot. Right, something like this. And now we have room for a big, nice park behind the school, which would make it look amazing. Let me lift all these streets first. In fact, maybe we can just uh, consider this lower terrain and we can have a bit of a uh, retaining wall here. From, I don't know. I mean, there, there could be a nice little neighborhood here as well. I'm not even sure. Just thinking out loud. Let's just keep it flat for now. Let's focus on the park, which uh, I think is going to be easier to accomplish. Let's go with the same treatment as the other one. Let's just have uh, the sidewalk theme. So something like that actually no because I want an entrance too so the entrance is I don't even know what the entrance is we can have this like so uh, this part right here I don't know how to make it so we're gonna need to do something like that And maybe we can just do that. That kind of works. And now let's just uh, have a bit of a uh, path getting in. Let's uh, find the connection, which I think is this one. There we go. And uh, maybe, yeah, let's just put it over here. Why not? Fantastic. So now that we need, all that we need is uh, a not two by one, but one by one. There we go. And we can put a kiosk too, which is this one. Boom. We can even put a kiosk over here. And now, if my calculations are correct, we can have, oh, we can have another entrance, which would be here. So now that we just have a path, basically which will consist of a straight and we need a T and a curve. So the T and the curve. There we go. That's a nice park. Yay. We can put some trees in here. Unfortunately, the prop kind. Oh my God. They just went all over. I mean, that actually kind of looks cool to be honest. It's like they're growing out of the sidewalk. Uh, I guess I, I think I'm gonna keep them. Just add a few more chestnuts, so just to hide the irregularities of, of, of such a design, I guess. But it looks nice. Or I wanna rotate it to the other side. Hang on. That is acceptable. Some trees are inside of the fence, some others are on the street, but of course you're not gonna chop down a tree just to have a, a, a path. I'm not... I'm, yeah, I'm defending myself, <laughs> but uh, I think it works. Uh, let's just uh, have a uh, fill over tree right there. Maybe not. No, let's just have a an empty filler plaza thing. Can we rotate it to an angle that sort of kind of matches? I wish I could get more uh, this side, uh, this little edge is here. I think this looks right. Can I have like an end? 
Actually, that works. Even though this is, I think, is designed for roundabouts. It kind of works because it overhangs, but just at the same time, it's kind of out of place. Let me see if I can find something better. And this it needs to be connected to a uh, path, so no. You know what? Let's just go with the tree. Wait, what is this? <laughs> yeah, these are all weird ends. Fill it with tree. Done. And uh, so let's uh, let's increase the funding on this one too. Money is no object in this city. And uh, oh, we got more development here. What is happening here? You don't have road access, but you do have road access. Let's let's give it a shot like that. And uh, bring down the trees. Let's get down different types of trees. There we go, fantastic. And uh, this is kind of working already. Let me rotate the camera real quick. What can we do over here? Well, let me just begin by having a bit of a uh, separation with, with trees. And uh, maybe we can zone this area right here. Something along those lines. Get some of that going. And uh, get uh, three by threes if we can. There we go, fantastic. And now we're just uh, gonna put trees in the back. Just filling the rest of the map. You know how much I love zoning by the edge of the map. <laughs> Let's get uh, some chestnuts as well. Are there any bus stops? Yeah, there's one over here. Is that the only one? Oh, there's another one over there. There should be one over here, I think. Getting the rest of the trees. Let's uh, let's speed it up real quick. Have the game do all the potential, the needed calculations. Let me just save the game as well, now that I have a, a minute. Take a sip of really cold coffee. <laughs> Not because it was cold, because it got cold. Or it went cold. All right, city saved. Let's just hope for the best. Let's hope for this. Let's wait for this to solve itself, which I'm sure it will. Come on, guys. Grow, grow, grow. Or maybe not. Don't grow. Do the opposite of what I tell you. Okay, so we got a different type of growth. But it's just a matter of moments. Let's just wait until all these guys are calculated again. I was thinking, can we do, maybe, maybe we can, uh, hmm, I was gonna say maybe do, we can do farms, but we had that discussion before, and for some reason I haven't done it. I think it's, oh yeah, because it's gonna pollute this entire area and it's not gonna be as fun for the people living there, for the most part. Uh, this will work itself out, I'm sure. There's, I thought this, I thought this was a, a growing building, <laughs> but it isn't, it is not. Uh, we should probably... Well, we have a hospital over here. We have a school. Uh, maybe police station would work? Because we haven't done that in a while. Let's put a, a big police station. Not a big police station, but a semi-sized large police station. Just put it right here in the corner. Let's bring, uh, bring in the... Actually, let's just have a road go around. There we go. See, now I'm not sure if I want to have like retaining walls here. I think it will look cool, but it's not going to be, I mean, 
It's not gonna be retaining anything in particular. Let's just let's just give it a shot. Let's see what it looks like. Something like that. You know what we need here? We need an end because it's uh, it's running really its flat. I don't want to. I want to. I don't want to have it uh, down on top. Right end, no prop. I think this is the wrong one. It is the wrong one, of course. Oh, it's so hard to to demolish these things when the trees are in the in the middle of the way. Uh, so this is the right end. So I need the left end. Top. There we go. Not what you're talking. Let's uh, let's bring these walls. Over here as well, and this is where it will end. So let's grab the, I guess, the right end in this case. Yep, exactly what I wanted. And of course, let's just uh, grab the little corner with the trees. So we have a bit of a retaining wall situation to go in here, which is great. I do want to get, oh, oh, I just need to demolish these trees. They're just so annoying. Uh, we're gonna have uh, one and two stairs just to add a bit more more detail to it Just think of this as people walking to the beach. Oh, you know what that that's exactly what we need to do We need to have a beach here. Oh, this is gonna be fantastic. Oh Yes, yes, I want to I want to bring this terrain up though. No, uh, not not what I wanted. No, sorry Sorry this is this is awful. Oh no! What am I doing? That's the worst part. I'm the one doing it. <laughs> um, let me see. Can I soften this out without destroying your life? You had the grid. If you had the grid, everything looks so much nicer. Um, let me bring this up, and let's uh, connect. Uh, do a few paths uh, to the beach down below i don't think i have any beach specific uh props unfortunately but uh we'll 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 give this a shot i feel like this too will be connected Maybe like that. This is gonna be one of those like long, at a ton of detail episodes. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> just a bit of green, just layering some nice props. There we go. And uh, let's uh, bring, is this, this is sand, right? This is a bit too strong, I think. Let's just uh, stick to the shoreline rocks. Let's just have a few little clusters of little rocks. Something like that. Let's not go too crazy with it, if we can. I really hate it when I, it just doesn't plop, I just click like a maniac. That's it with this uh, little part. We can have uh, the mix uh, random things. <laughs> oh, there's trees, fagus. Do we want to have uh, an industrial like shack on the beach? <laughs> Probably not. Um, what I want to add though is uh, hopefully I can add. Sorry about that. I just say something really. I just said something really, really dumb, 
and I had to <laughs> I had to edit it out of the of the of the video. Um, yeah, sorry. It's really no no not that much fun if you can. Oh, these flowers don't look like flowers at all. They're just noise. Weeds, uh, straw. Let me plop some of these. Oh, these ones are nice. I used them before. Sometimes I say dumb things and I leave them, but this one was way too dumb and inappropriate as well. Especially inappropriate. That's why you won't be hearing it from me for now. <laughs> we'll see we'll see we'll see what the future holds. Uh, lily pads. I think uh, lily pads are no necessary. Not really. What I do want is maybe people in bathing suits or something. I don't know. What are these? Marsh. Oh, that that looks nice. Something like that. And now I'm gonna add some trees, of course, just to cover all the imperfections. Scroll all the way up. I'm gonna grab our classic ashes. Of course, I'm gonna do less of them. And every time I say that, I just keep clicking frantically like a maniac and just add, say, a ton of them. But I guess that should be enough. Uh, in fact, uh, let's grab some chestnuts as well, of course. Something like that. This looks so nice. Uh, we can even put uh, some of the villa houses because it's, you know, kind of a private uh, beach site. Beach site. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know where they are. They're probably somewhere here. Menus are not scrolling as fast as I would like it to. Scroll down a little bit. They were right at the top. Yeah, here where they are. Uh, it's a bit too big, and, and the terrain, I don't think the terrain is... It's appropriate. And also, I don't want to repeat the same style. Like, feels like... You know what? For the next episode, I'll get some props and just design a nice little beach over here with the actual people, you know, sunbathing or whatever. I don't know. What, whatever people do in the beach. I'm, I have the beach five blocks from my house and I almost never go just so you know <laughs> yeah you can you can hate me but it's it's one of those things that it's very common like there's a lot of attractions probably in the city where you live and you never go because they're there you can go anytime and you never go I used to go to the beach a lot when I didn't live next to the beach now that I live next to the beach I don't go there I don't know it's weird how 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 that happens. What I'm doing here with the trees, I honestly have no idea. I'm just trying to get a bit of a pattern going. Oh, you know what we can do? We can have many of these uh, little paths. Oh, we can have the path just go around and uh, meet with each one of these streets. Oh, that's gonna look fantastic. Okay, yeah, let's give that a shot real quick. That's going to be great, man. That's going to be great. So we want the shoreline pebbles, I think. Something like that. Just going to lay it out a little bit and then we will. Oh, no, that is that is very, very bad. Should probably put down the trees later after I'm done with this. I think you would agree that it's probably not a good idea for me to do this this way. Come on, let me. Oh, this is gonna look great. 
at least at this zoom level. Uh, if you zoom out too much, it just starts to look uh, a bit weird. See, when you zoom out too much, it just looks a bit fake. But uh, don't worry, we'll make it. We'll make it look nice. And of course, uh, this is going to be, it's going to feature all these other props that we have here. In case you didn't know, what's the next street? Wow, the next street is kind of far away, huh? Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to, I'm going to put a quick cut on this episode here. Uh, you kind of get the idea of, uh, of what I'm trying to do. Let me hit play. And actually, you know what? Let me, let me just hit save. Let me show you in the meantime, what, uh, what we did. So I think uh, with this design, we can just start replicating it uh, across this path and basically just have like beach access to fr from the road. In fact, we can probably lower the entire the entire area underneath and just have this retaining walls instead, and these connected with stairs to the actual water, which I think will be nice. We could, we most certainly need one path to calm down and meet the water here, and we probably need another one over here. Um, but I think that this looks great. I mean, we can fill this whole area with this design. It's going to take a little while, but, uh, but I think the result is going to be, it's going to be a good one. So, uh, if you enjoy thus far, please uh, give this video a rating. That's very much appreciated. And also please do not forget to subscribe if you haven't already, if you're new to the channel. Um, I've been, uh, this hopefully will be the last, uh, pre-recorded episode as I'm, uh, back uh, in Los Angeles. And um, we'll see what the future holds. I'm, I'm recording this one month ago, basically. When you're watching this, it means that this was recorded exactly a month ago. And um, I don't know what ideas we'll, I will have in a month. I guess we'll see. It's a bit of a surprise. I also want to be reading your comments and suggestions uh, of things that I can do. But uh, yeah, I'm going to miss the city for a month. For you, it's just going to be one week, right? But... Uh, that's kind of strange how that works. Huh. Anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a good one.